in this video i'll be teaching you how to get 200 dollars for free in order to run your trading robot 247 on a virtual private server which we call the vps so first thing you want to do is go to google and if you're new to this channel kindly hit the subscribe button and also stay in the know when i release fresh content by hitting the notification icon i'm danny legend and you're welcome to boom and crash expert advisor so while you are you are at google you can just type in azure microsoft okay it is a cloud computing service and it should lead you here and the first thing you want to do is to sign up but you can go to free account or even before you sign up you can just click free account and then it will tell you create your uh, your azure free account and you can click on start free and so it will lead you to a sign up page but because i have already signed up or, or already logged in it will tell me that it looks like you already have an azure account the azure free account is only available to new users and it's limited to one per customer so i'm going to use an existing subscription in my account And this will lead me to my dashboard so when i come here i would see that out of my i'll wait for a while yes so out of my 200 i've used about 63 okay so i have 137.45 credits remaining so you can come to create a resource let's even go to virtual machines first and you click create a virtual machine so i have already created one danny legend you can see here you click create a virtual machine so whilst you're here you can uh, choose yes azure subscription and then new resource group uh, you can click create new and type in a name and i typed in danny legend so when you do that you can name your virtual machine i named it danny legend as well you can choose the region where you want it to be located so usually you want to choose a place that is close to you so if you're in europe you want to choose maybe you know uk uh france and all that uh, if it's available germany france and all that so uh, you can also go to uh, availability zone i think these ones you don't really have to touch them and you go down and then for the image you can go with windows server 2019 data center then the size the specs of the machine uh, i'm using uh, four uh, uh, cpus four virtual cpus and 16 gig memory but if you want something that costs less you can go with one cpu one virtual cpu or you can go with two these ones cost less but mind you it's still free you still have uh, 200 dollars free so all right you are good to go then you can type in username i used an legend and then i typed in my password and then confirm password so there are rules about the password and then the rules about the username says it cannot contain special characters so on and so forth it must not include reversed words the value is in between one and 20 characters long then you go along with all that and then when you are done you click review and create so it has a if it has a problem they'll tell you if not uh, you are good to go review and create when you do that it should lead you to something like this that i have here so this is my machine i can click it and it says your unsaved edits yes because i was just teaching you this so i'm just click ok now this is my machine this is what i created okay so i can come down all right so i can just click on start and it's going to start so if i click on start it would lead me to a new interface and then it says started virtual machine successfully started virtual machine danny legend so since my uh, machine has been created i can press the window key and i'll type remote desktop connection when this pops up i'll put in my ip address now i have other several machines so uh, this ip address will be this this is what i'm going to copy copy to clipboard and that is where uh, i'm going to paste it so i'm going to paste it here 
and this is a port number that uh, I later on had to add so this is something different so don't worry about it just use your public IP address which is the same as this and then your username you enter your username if they ask you and then you connect this is going to open up and you see that this is uh, a new dashboard with my IP at the top and I could open my server manager and I'll go to local server and then for the I the IE enhanced security configuration you can turn it off so you click on it and then you turn them off off here off there you click OK and then you can close it this is because you want to use Google Chrome and if you have it on the Internet Explorer would interfere with Google Chrome so from here you can choose to uh, open your Google Chrome you can download it with your Explorer so you open your Explorer and then you type in download Chrome download Chrome and then you download the Chrome and install it so you download now and you install when you're done you can install your MetaTrader you can you know do whatever you want run your robot and the way to go offline and still keep your your robot running is you can always close this when you close this it doesn't affect it so for instance let me just open um let me just open anything let me open mt5 so if i open mt5 and i close my let's say i'm running a, a, a robot okay it's running i've turned my algo trading on and everything if i close this you will see that it will still be running so back to uh so i'm going to reopen my um remote computer and you see that it will still be running so i can go here remote desktop i can open it again um from here this is it daniel legend connect it's connecting and when it opens up you will see that my mt5 is still running it didn't close which means that even if you close that and you turn off your laptop it will still run the robot so that is how you set up your um, vps to run your robots 247 so you can also go back to your azure dashboard and stop your machine or, or give it a pause or whatever you want to do with it so let's go back and see how that works so let's say i'm closing this now when i come here i can stop it i can also delete it and when you look here you'll be given it says started virtual machine you'll be given how much you have left whilst the bot is running so it is only when your credit finishes that you are actually going to pay as you go so that is how you set it i'm going to stop this because i'm not using it. i was just doing it for demonstration purposes so stop here do you want to stop the legend yes and it's stopping it so it's not going to charge me from the 200 dollar balance because i've stopped the machine so if you stop it it means that your bot and everything that is running will not run but then if you want to if you want to close this you can simply close but don't click stop and your bot will still be running so that is how you set up your buffer free for $200 free uh, VPS service. So if you like this video, drop a like. I appreciate it. And also sub subscribe to the channel for more content. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks and bye.